Welcome to this video where we will be exploring Crossrail 2, a proposed railway project that could transform transportation in London and the surrounding areas. Crossrail 2 has been the subject of much debate and anticipation since its initial proposal in 2013. It aims to provide a high capacity, high frequency rail service that would link southwest and northeast London, connecting major hubs. Crossrail 2 is a proposed hybrid commuter rail and a rapid transit route in South. Southeast England, running from nine stations in Surrey to three in Hertfordshire, providing a new north south rail link across Greater London. It would connect the South West Main Line to the West Angelia Main Line via Victoria and King's Cross St. Pancreas. It is intended to alleviate severe overcrowding that would otherwise occur on commuter rail route into central London by 2030. Should permission be granted, construction is expected to start around 2023 with the new line opening from early 2030. The proposed line would be approximately 30 miles long and would have approximately 30 stations. It would also connect with other major rail lines and underground services. Crossrail 2 would transform travel in the region and improve connectivity throughout the UK. Crossrail 2 would have a major impact on the connectivity of the whole nation's rail network with around 35% of the UK's rail network and more than 800 stations around the country benefiting from the project. Crossrail Rail 2 would generate extra tax revenues to help fund the scheme and could be worth up to £102 billion to the UK economy. Crossrail 2 would serve areas of London that are currently poorly connected and would help to relieve congestion on the existing transport network. Crossrail 2 would generate new jobs and opportunities for small and medium sized enterprises, with SME benefiting for more than £5 billion of spend. Crossrail 2 is a proposed hybrid commuter rail and rail rapid transit route in southeast London running from nine stations in Surrey to three in Hertfordshire providing a new north-south rail link across Greater London 1. The line would link the southwest of the capital from Clapham Junction to the northeast towards Seven Sisters and would be extended to link Surrey to Hertfordshire. New tunnels would be created underneath the centre of the capital to accommodate the project. The line would have 47 stations. The estimate cost of the project is around 30 3 billion pounds. Crossrail 2 is an ambitious proposal aimed at linking the suburban rail networks of South West and North East London with the new tunnel under the city. The estimated cost of the Crossrail 2 project varies depending on the source and time frame. The latest estimate from 2019 by Transport for London and the Department for Transport put the total cost of the project at around 33 billion to 40 billion pounds. That's all for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching.